Does the brand of computer you have determine what you're offered for an online hotel reservation? Jesse Jones did some comparison pricing using an iPad and a PC, and what he found may change the way you travel. Spring training is right around the corner, so before stepping up to the plate in search of reservations for the Arizona trip, you may want to take a swing with different computers. Okay, so the first thing we have to do is get hotel rooms. So what we're going to do is check for hotel prices. We're going to check Orbit on a Mac, and then we'll also check it on a PC. Let's see if there's any difference. Our trip, two nights in a Scottsdale hotel. I searched on an iPad, and we found some decent pricing on the first page of search results. Everything from 400 bucks a night to others, less than 150. Let's see how low we can go on a PC. This is my computer. I don't do any shopping on it except ordering court documents. And check out the first page of results here. These prices are definitely lower. You're talking 88, 79. Why is this a lot lower than if I looked at the very same trip on an iPad? It's absolutely smart business. Eric Best is the CEO of Merson. His company helps online retailers competitively price millions of items each day. We know that retailers and travel companies and ticket companies are looking at the device uh, on which you're shopping, and increasingly they're looking at your shopping history. So let's try this again. I go to a third computer and I clear the cookies. All right, let's go shopping at Walmart and see what happens. Let me buy some underwear and a shirt. How does that sound? After filling up my basket, I price the trip again. And what shows up on the first page? More cheap hotels. And looky here, low, low prices. How about that? 86 bucks pops up now. The prices for the rooms did not change for each computer, but what was offered on that first page did. We tried the same thing with other travel sites, but we saw nothing like this. We contacted Orbitz looking for comment, and they didn't get back to us. So what's Eric's best tip to price almost anything online? Check the price at work, check it at home, check it on your phone, and make sure that you're seeing consistent numbers. And also search to see the lowest prices. And don't go by the first page alone. The 0-1 pitch of the way, swing and a high fly ball deep into center field. Bottom line, before planning a trip, become an elusive target. In Seattle, Jesse Jones, King 5 News.